ten of twenty-five crystals. You're on your way. I'm running low on power, so communication from this point will be difficult. Again, be wary of the pathways between wolf ruins. Remember, I'm counting on you. Okay, pressure's on. So, let's head on up to the next warp room. Going up. And who are we going to be facing this time? What have I got? You're new. <laughs> Meet. The Komodo Brothers, ladies and gentlemen. I honestly only know one of their names. Basically, what you do is they will spin around when he stops spinning around. Hit. That is Komodo Joe that we just uh, hit and spun into his brother. Now, I don't remember what the fatter Komodo Dragon's name is off the top of my head. I'll probably put that on screen. Basically, the Komodo Brothers are pretty easy. There's only one boss in this game I really find kind of difficult. Going. There we go. One more hit, and the Komodo Bros are done. I will insult them. Alright. Now he'll start to throw the swords out. Whoops, I did not mean to get that close. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oi, 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 oi. I'm, I'm sorry. And. Boom. Pelvic thrust in their face crash. They deserve it. <laughs> and there we go. Whee! Where were they in? Like a circus or something? Water. Another thing games don't like. Good show, Crash. The Komodo brothers obviously lacked your metal. But now is not the time to get cocky. There are still many crystals to obtain. Remember, the world is counting on you. Well, world's gonna have to wait until next episode, guys.